It's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. Mr. Rogers promoted that idea, and at least that's still the hope in Appleton. The city encouraging a project to make the city stronger. As Fox 11's Alex Ronaldo explains, one neighborhood at a time. Aaron Arndt has lived in this Appleton neighborhood for 13 years. We know everybody by first name. We look out for each other. The kids play together. Arndt recently helped expand her neighborhood watch into the city's relatively new neighborhoods program and is the point person for city leaders. The goal of the program is to strengthen neighborhoods um, and, and really improve communication between City Hall and Appleton's neighborhoods. Neighbors can register their neighborhoods with the city by electing a primary contact person, mapping out boundaries, and picking a name. City planner Brad Schmidt says there are no fees or restrictions under registration. The idea behind the program is that each neighborhood is unique with its own strengths and its own weaknesses or problems that need to be solved. When you register, you can really make that your identity and, and, and try to solve any issues that are unique to your neighborhood. Registrants can attend free workshops about subjects like demographics and leadership skills. Some are also eligible for city grants for local improvements to pay for things like parks. Finally, Schmidt says the program encourages more dialogue among neighborhood leaders, the city, and any potential developers. We're seeing that that's a successful part of it. So far, there are 10 registered neighborhoods, including Art's Winding Brook Watch. She says not much has changed with the registration yet, but she's excited to see where it goes. Work together, brainstorm, and find out what we can do to make life better in Appleton. In Appleton, Alex Ranallo, Fox 11 News. Since summer, about one-fourth of the city's neighborhoods have signed on. Green Bay has a similar program encompassing about three dozen neighborhood associations covering about three-fourths of that city.